Sharon Haver. I'm the founder of FocusOnStyle.com. We're here today at Barney's New York for About.com, and we're going to talk about how to accessorize the perfect cocktail dress and how to get more mileage out of your LBD. Nora, our model, and she's wearing an absolutely gorgeous black matte satin cocktail dress. It's a very simple little black dress, but you may want to change and try a couple of different alternatives, so that's what we're going to show you how to do. So what we did here is we added an evening belt that has a little diamante buckle. It still might be a diamond buckle, but it is a very simple clean line which doesn't distract from the line of the dress and acts as an accent. Think of your belt as an accessory or a jewel and you don't need anything else. But if you want to brighten it up, there's nothing that works more beautiful then a shot of color. And we have this bright satin bag and this very, very brilliant magenta, which just pops everything out of the dress. And that's really all you need, it's good to go for a party and to completely change the way the dress started to look. So another way to change the look of this dress is to maybe dress it down, but dress it up a bit. So what we have here is this really beautiful, bold necklace. It's very, very bold and it makes a huge statement. And it's something that changes the whole look of the dress and it's a little bit unexpected. But what I would do is because the most important thing is to make an entrance. And I follow sort of the advice of Audrey Hepburn at Breakfast and Tiffany's and wear a beautiful trench over your cocktail dress. And roll up the sleeve a little bit. And just the combination of the trench and the big necklace, it's just a very chic look. It kind of takes it down a bit as being a little more casual, but I kind of think of it as being a little bit more downtown than wearing a fussy coat over a cocktail dress. It's a little younger and a little fresher. Here's another alternative for a very uptown kind of look. It's the same dress, but she can wear it to lunch, she could wear it to the office, she can wear it to maybe a daytime event or occasion. And we'd simply put on this little cropped beige jacket, which you can also wear later with other things and dress up a pair of jeans with or a pair of white jeans. And we've added a very, we're not going for the kind of usual pearls. We went for, again, the very simple pearls, which are on a black cord, which makes it a little younger and a little more fresh and more important, less serious. And it became a very, very elegant dress that you can get more mileage out of and wear during the day. Now, depending on your black cocktail dress, this one has the little shoulder detail, but if your dress doesn't have the shoulder detail, we can also put a simple cardigan on, kind of a la Michelle Obama, and get the same feel or even dress it down further. But what you need to think of is just the shape of the dress and what makes this jacket work is that it has a very slight sheen to it. Even though it's casual, it still has a sheen which complements the sheen in the dress. Here we have Nora looking very grown up and very, very elegant in a very sophisticated look. And we're using lots of berries because this is our very expensive edition. We have our gorgeous fine jewelry earrings, which whenever you get a gift like that, you want to show them off. And you have your perfect dress and this absolutely magnificent black satin trench coat. So it's not something that's so chic and sophisticated. And it's a completely different vibe with the same dress than the very very young kind of way of throwing the off-handed trench coat over it. You realize that if you start thinking out of the box, you get so many more options. Thanks for watching, and for more, visit us on the web at about.com.